Assalamualaikum and hello YouTube. My name is Nur Muhammad from NM, NM Watch based in Malaysia and yes we are back with another One Watch 5 new looks right so where we going to talk about 5 straps of stra strap fashion show for a watch uh, for you to choose from right so because you don't really want to buy new watch every single day so what you can do is you can make your old watch looks new so in this case this is a quite I, I don't know I think this is like 10 years back model so they don't really pr Hamilton doesn't produce this thing anymore so this is the Hamilton khaki navy uh, <laughs> khaki navy titanium frogman right so that is a very very long name and yeah this one is quite a beast a huge beast guys so a uh, diameter of 43 millimeters from here to here and the lug to lug of 53 millimeters which is still okay but check out that thickness that thing is 18 millimeters in thickness so this luckily it is made it is made using titanium so it's not really going to be that heavy and uh, luckily it has this 22 millimeters so I have tons of straps to play around with this particular watch right so uh, first up is this um, love watch strap elastico strap elastico strap so I think this they call this the Raven so there are a few other colorways as well and this is one inside the um, uh, bond series so we have this elastic material here and yeah I think it it doesn't really add that much thickness because you know it is a single pass construction here of course not single pass but there's still only one piece of material at the bottom of the watch right so before we put on this particular watch on my skinny 6.75 inch wrist let's do a quick wristwatch check today I am wearing my San Martin SN021B this is an homage to a certain to the black base the six but to do themselves never release this Tiffany blue dial so I think yeah it makes it quite unique in my opinion right so so from this <laughs> small little watch to this big huge chunky watch right so let's see how this thing looks on my 6.75 inch wrist so does it look ridiculous does it look cool I don't know let's see how it looks and yeah what do you guys think right so yeah that is how it looks quite tall I must say not really my preference but yeah still if this is your kind of uh, watch so there yeah, this is one of the options that you could choose for your uh, particular watch right this is strap number one let's go to strap number two which is from okay let's just take this quick release pins first let's take it out so I don't really want to stop it. and just, yep this is another silver color strap or metal strap this but then you see there's no holes here right so basically this is uh, I think I don't really remember what a spring made shop call this one but they're still they call it super adjustable or highly adjustable I don't really remember but they're still a very very unique uh, uh, buckle system here a movable keeper here and a fixed keepers here right so I think they come with uh, this gray blue red and a few other color options as well but yeah I, don't, I can't really remember so what we do what we need to do is put back those quick release spin oh the good thing about this particular watch is that you can see this you can see here that there are two holes so yeah that, that is why you can easily fit uh, what type of strap there according to your preference so if you prefer it tighter put it if you if you prefer the holes to be clear uh, nearer to the watch case so you can choose the bottom uh, hole and yeah that is what I'm gonna do here because the thickness the strap thickness is not really that thick so that is an option that I'm going to use as of now right so let's just put it on the watch and see how it looks like a gray color of course matches any quite a lot of um, you know dial colors here so yeah that is I, th I think it looks cool but when you want to wear it right so you have to practice give it a bit give it a bit of practice here so what you do here is you're gonna slide it through this first um, this buckle here right so you're gonna slide it up like so it's quite difficult to, de to do behind the camera guys so and next what you need to do is just flick this uh, buckle here and let the strap slide through the keeper right so like that okay so when now you're gonna have to check whether it is loose or too tight so like now it's a bit too loose so I'm just gonna have to just pull a little bit of material from this side to oh my god like that and 
going to put it back again through the uh, keepers here right and boom you are good to go so since this wall is quite tall normally i have a few uh, centimeters material left so yeah i could flip i could f uh, just uh, fold this uh, end of the strap to to this uh, adjustable keeper here but yeah this is a quick a quite a huge watch so that is why i'm want, not gonna have that much materials left right so this is the spring made adjustable nato strap right so this is our strap number two and let's go to strap number three right so that is why i just i just love nato strap you can just take it off and boom you are good to go to a newer watch a newer strap so this black and beige number is from diywatchclub.com so you have this t logo up top so you can adjust this um the length of the strap according to your wrist size so i've adju already adjusted to my wrist size but still this is quite a thick watch so let's see how it looks right so i'm just gonna slide it through boom you are good to go <laughs> i think right so yeah i just love the how that black and beige looks on this titanium watch titanium uh, case watch right so i think i have now nah, not that much materials left <laughs> right so yep I, I could take off and put put in more materials here but I don't really want it because yeah this is how it looks and yeah I think that look it looks just fine but yeah still if you own one of these um, uh, titanium frogman <laughs> Hamilton so you might want to consider to buy a longer strap right so this is strap number three and let's go to strap number four which is another from another strap maker that I really really like and I've used quite a lot in the past so this is from blueshockstraps.com so we have this single pass construction mid construction strap and this material is quite soft and supple and it is something that I've never um, hold never felt before so very very nice I yeah I've just received this two days back and yeah it feels and looks awesome right so we have this um very very unique uh buck brush buckle here you can see that the shape is not your typical keeper shape so that's very cool and we have that blue shark strap uh, sign at the top of the buckle right so we just have to slide this through the strap and see how it fits okay so because this is a single pass construction so of course it's not going to be adding that much of a thickness to the wash to this very very uh tall and top heavy watch right so let's just see if i can do this in one go okay right so i am on the fifth hole right so you can see that even we on this uh, 18 millimeters 18 millimeters i watch so you still have quite a lot of materials left so you just have to fold it back in and make sure it goes into the uh, the movable keeper so that it won't flop around that much when you are wearing it so yeah let's just yep that is how it looks and i just love this dark gray color maybe it has a little bit of blue inside it and yeah i just love how it looks and what do you guys think right so this is strap number four and let's go to strap number five which is my favorite strap of the bunch right so if you guys have been following me on the channel for the past few years so you will know that i absolutely like love this particular strap so this is from vario singapore so this is their kodura single pass kodura strap right so we have this kodura material on the top in green khaki green and we have this um uh, what do you call this uh, rivet right so whole rivet which is made from stainless steel that is why you never see any uh, rust whatsoever and we have this uh, fixed buckle here with sorry fixed keepers here with a fixed buckle which is signed vario on the top there all right so let's see if i can slide through this strap no so this is why it is great to have this <laughs> this extra you know ex little bit of you know uh, space here so you have to put it on the top hole so that i can have much bigger gap and uh, so that i can uh, slide through that thick uh, strap right so this vario kodura strap is going to be uh, about two millimeters in thickness that is why you, you you need to have that extra space here so okay so let's do this again all right so yep that's very very good 
it may we managed to slide it in and we just slide it once more so yeah that looks good right so green color green khaki green with a you know a bit blasted uh, watch case is you know what just a match made in heaven in my opinion right so let's just put it on my wrist right so let's see how this thing look um yeah i don't i don't i'm not really sure yet why f um hamilton put the name frogman in here maybe they have um you know a collaboration with the the those frogmans frogmen <laughs> and will while testing this watch i'm not really sure but yeah still this is how the strap looks right so you can see that because of the thing is the any strap that i put on it be all immediately becomes short right so that is what you need to uh, understand with this uh, super duper thick watch right so there we have it guys five different five new uh, look for your if you have this right it's hamilton khaki navy titanium frogman watch right so and uh, an absolute beast in my opinion and yeah i i this is a borrowed watch so i myself would not buy it but still if you have one of these if you have one of these so this five strap might be a great option for you so so if you guys like this video please give me a big thumbs up and if you want to see more future video reviews such as this one please go ahead and subscribe to my channel until next time i'll see you soon stay safe and bye bye